curls. See if we can stretch your legs and open the lungs up a bit. Guys. Is that a smile? Are you smiling? You're so serious, huh? That's good to see. Good to see, darling. Well done. Thank you. Ah. What do you think about this, huh? What do you think about this place? What do you think about this place, mate? Hey! <laughs> what do you think about this place? Oh. 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 Yeah, hi. Is this fun? Is this fun? Yeah, it's fun, I think, isn't it? Oh, you like it? Hey? What do you think? Oh, what do you think? Yeah. Yeah, good girl, good girl, <laughs> good girl, darling. Yeah, good job, good job, good girl. She's a bit of a tough cookie, tough nut to crack, but I think I'm starting to break through to her. I can see she's starting to, hello, yeah, hi. Starting to uh, acknowledge me and, um, Look at me in the eyes. Look back for me. Not just running off. Ah, oh, yeah, good girl, darling. That's it. Yeah, good girl. Good girl. So this is a good sign. This is what I was looking for. I need them to start to take note of me and what I'm saying when I'm talking to them. Uh, take direction from me, whether it be, you know, to do with their behaviour or whether it to do with where we're going. Um, just so long as they're following me, coming along. If she was still really aloof, and just doing her own thing and I'm just riding around and she's not even taking note, then, uh, uh, you know, that's what she was doing yesterday and this morning um, on the lead, but she seems to have turned a bit of a corner, let her guard down a little bit, having a bit of fun. Hey, got a smile out of you. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Oh, good girl. Good girl. So it means that I'll most likely be able to let her off lead around some of the other dogs and she's likely to listen. When they're really aloof and not, not taking much note. Oh, a bit of a yawn. Um, it's a bit of a risk. You know, it's likely they're not going to listen to you. But So far, she's looking pretty good. She's had a couple of little barks and growls and just pretty standard stuff for a dog coming out of a shelter. But what's good about her is she does go through the levels of escalation. So, you know, straight away all day yesterday, she was very staunch and stiff and tall and, you know, putting on a really strong body language. As if to say, I'm not weak, you can't pick on me to all the other dogs, which is exactly what we've spoken about in our previous um, videos around the shelter dogs and their behavior and their world uh, you know if you're weak you're going to be picked on you're going to be a target uh, so she's showing strength she's standing tall head nice and high chest up high um, stiff body language you know really walking through the playground like this you know really like I'm, I'm big and tough but I, she didn't erupt. She didn't uh, lash out, and and she wasn't trying to actively dominate any of the dogs, which is a really good sign for her. Um, she was just sort of putting up a bit of a front to say, "Hey, you can't pick on me," but she also wasn't trying to pick on anyone either. So that's a pretty good sign. I think. If we can um, continue to allow her to drop her guard and soften a little bit, 
she'll probably start to have a bit of fun and, and play with the other dogs. She hasn't shown any interest to play with any of the dogs just yet, but she has shown, uh, you know, uh, intense focus. Oh, hello, darling. Oh, <laughs> that's knocked me off. Come on. Come on, come on. Good girl. Good girl. She's head straight into the side of me. Tried to get up, but miscalculated it. Um, what was I saying there? I got distracted. Hey, Ooh, I like your new collar. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Um, lost my train of thought. Sorry, guys. Not sure where I was going with that. Can't even remember where, what my point of the conversation was, but uh, it was good signs from her. Um, and then whenever she did growl or bark at another dog, she did show, she did go through those levels of escalation. So she, the hackles went up first, then the body language, um, or it was down at a dinner bowl and another dog was real up close next to her uh, through the cage, she growled, um, and I straight away opened the cage, stood in front of her, said no, nope, waved the finger in front of her face. She kind of like, what? Hmm? What's this? Um, again, a very good sign. She's taken note of me and gone, oh, am I not allowed to do that? Um, and then this is the first time here that I've seen her bark at the other dogs, but that's because they're on the other side of the fence and they're going bananas at, um, at me on the bike. Yeah, go, 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 go. <laughs> I think she's pretty excited to be running around. Um, <clears throat> so her behavior, she was very focused. I think this is where I was before. She's very focused on the intensity of the other dogs. So she is very alert and dr drawn to any fast movement, any barking out of excitement for the toys or the balls or the game. So they're the kind of things that I need to watch for her, which is why she's on a solo motorbike run um, to start with. And as we start to get the other dogs involved, I'll have to start to watch those interactions and what she's doing and is she playing with the game? Is she watching the dogs? Is she... Um, focusing on the dogs you know are the dogs her priority or is it being out having fun doing what she's doing now having a sniff around being excited that she's free to roam and, and play um, so <clears throat> let's go do an introduction let's go let the other dogs out I'll have her on lead uh, I don't think I need her on a muzzle at this point I'll just have her on lead and See, here we go, let's assess how she performs. Yeah, she gets, she's got a bit of a spring in her step. What you doing? Yeah! What you doing? What you doing? Yeah! <laughs> Does look back, I give her a verbal uh, phrase to reassure that yes, that's the behaviour that I want. I want you to keep checking in with me. So, you have to catch for a while to come to the direction. You find yourself off by yourself.
Good girl. So she was running a little bit too long between checking back in and started to wander off. So that's why I changed direction, make her make her start to want to check in a little bit more regularly in case she misses something. Which is good. Good girl, darling. Good girl. Yeah, well done.